I, I got to go back to what you told me before that you were looking at what was that a 2009 playoff game and you were on staff of Denver taking on the Lakers, right? Um, yep. and you, eight, 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 nine. Yep. Okay. Uh, and at one point during that part of the conversation, you said um, it was something about defending Kobe on inbounds passes or something like that. Or and what did you learn? What do you learn from watching Kobe back in the day that you can download to your team right now? I mean, just his poise, his, his, I mean, you talk about the mentality. He just wasn't going to let that team, that team lose. Um, and I, what I had originally showed the guys was his mentality of when the reporter asked him when they put, actually played Orlando, they said, why aren't you smiling? You're up 2-0. And he said, the job's not done. And more than anything, it was the mentality of like, you haven't accomplished anything yet. And I think that's what tries, what resonates with our guys is that, yes, everyone's saying where we are and what we're doing and the streak is good, but what have we done? And I think trying to make that help our guys understand that is very important and it keeps you humble enough to know that there's still room to grow to get better and we still have things that we want to achieve to help each one of these guys become successful so you tell people in your video department cut me that sound bite and and then play it for the play for the guys yep when when do you play for them after practice Uh, or or something like that? no i mean we will do some before practice we did one the other day before before a detroit game i think just Little things, little you know, snippets that you can take from from anyone that has done it at a high level, and it's the mindset that you have to take going into these games. Um, and part of it is, as you make a playoff push, you you realize guys are going to be sore, you're going to be beat up, and and how do you respond to that? Especially with a young group, continue to learn how to win, uh, taking advice and and you know the lead of guys who have been there and that have done it at a high level. Uh, you can learn so much from that. Now, do you watch their faces when you hit play on the Kobe soundbite, or do you watch the soundbite? What do you do? I watch their faces. I watch their faces. And what did you see? You, you recognize that when when they see him on the screen, eyes light up. You know, there's an automatic mm. respect factor and a care factor, and just knowing what he has meant for to th- this game and each one of these young guys is – you can't put it into words so when they see him on the screen it's like automatic you know just knowing who he is and how much he's impacted their lives catch the rich eisen show every single day on the roku channel 12 to 3 eastern for free 